okay so here we write cmd uh, dot parameters dot add with value of it's asking for parameter name so what is the parameter name first we have I'll write at img path comma and the object value is what is that text box one dot text the next thing is a cmd dot uh, parameters add with value and next next is img image comma it's asking for object value or simply we are posting the array of the pick array because it's an image we simply pass that a byte it's a binary data it will convert it into binary data and it will pass to that particular column okay now cn dot open so int res space res is equals to cmd dot execute non query so that whenever you say execute non query it will execute and I'll put this one in try statement okay so if res is greater than zero then it will say message box dot show of the image store sorry store success fully say it and in the catch statement I'll write simply catch exception space ex it will and uh, message box dot sh show of ex dot message property I'll call message property and it will print the message property it's a, it's, it's a string property so you can see that whenever it's a, it, it got any runtime error you okay, can automatically see the error and if here I write catch sorry not catch I write finally final statement I, in this finally I'll write cn dot close okay that's done so simply you say if I if I run this file I just browse it you see the browse if I click on this and you see there is a syntax near into okay we'll see what it is okay um, ing yeah it's a insert not insert okay so yeah you see image stored successfully if I if you go to server and you'll right click on this and say show table data and you'll see what it look like you see image is a binary data you cannot see it but now you call it you'll see so you can see image path is this one and this one is a image data so that's good now we'll, we'll store this one and this is a storage of the image now we'll see how to retrieve it okay so I'll just close these forms I'll go to add I'll, so I'll go to solution explorer and I'll add one windows form which is called else a form 2 okay in this area you see I need to execute this one so uh, to execute it I'll go to form 1 and I simply put one button copy this one paste you see this now here I'll change this one text photos so that you can click on that you'll see all the photos so now I'll in the form I'll simply drop one list box 
so I can display all the images at uh, all image parts at one place whenever I select the image part and it will show the image in picture box so I'll draw one more picture box in this area so I'll simply place the pic now whenever I click on the list box and it will see those image so double click whenever Windows is lower it has to load all image parts so I'll simply go here and call I'll write uh, using uh, system dot io and not only that I'll write using a uh, system dot data dot and SQL client so here I write my connections I write SQL SQL connection all right CN equals to so okay CN and write SQL command so I write CMD and next thing is SQL uh, don't worry about that so next one is memory string right MS I'll save it now come to the form and write in this area simply CN is equals to new SQL connection of I just go to I'll right click on this one go to properties and you'll see connection string simply copy that and put at symbol and paste it control Z okay save it now we write SQ sorry CMD equals to new command and in this command I write select uh, star from TBL IMG and comma CN here when we are executing this I simply say CN dot open the connection is open uh, now here I write try and the same as catch exception space ex not only that and I write a finally a cn dot open sorry cn dot close so don't forget this one if you forget this one you will face some errors so in this area I write message box dot show ex dot message ok that's good now in this write statement I'll simply write a while ok you see this one is here I write sql data reader uh, dr I initialize this one here in the try statement dr is equals to cmd dot data reader execute execute data reader so whatever the data will be there in the table it will store in the data sorry about that sorry it's a data adapter it's not data adapter it's a D data reader okay now you said that read while well, read you just go right in this area write a list box one dot items dot add of the C D R of IMG part dot to string. So if I run this one now, I just go right in this area. I simply click on the photos. It has to open the form form. 
form 2 f is equals to new form 2 and write in this area f dot show so now if I run this one you see this image so if I say photo you'll see the simple image path in this area so good now I'm really sorry stop now I'll go to my again form 2 and I'll click on list box whenever I click on list box you'll see it, it will generate select index change event so simply write in this area I'll I'll just cover these things okay I need those things okay I'll simply compare it. I'll paste this one in this event exact event okay now save it here you see if before we are writing this one it's automatically getting that area in this I write simple where I am G path equals to So list box one dot selected item. Yeah, it's still giving you why I suppose. Yeah, selector item. So it will get the selector item at that point. Okay. So next thing we'll see. We have to whatever we get it. We have to convert them into memory stream and then it has to display in my sorry in the picture box sorry about that uh, 